Oh, what's up, people? Dobbs Rules is right here, and welcome to another Yu Gi Oh! pack opening. Welcome to February. I was supposed to record this around December, it's now hitting January, people, on this recording. It's because I was extremely ill, I had a Christmas bug, so I'm in a massive um, delay of videos, and I need to make them quickly and everything. But we have not given up that easily, people. Today, please check out Funky Figures. Now, so funky Figures, they are awesome. If you guys want to see me in person, you go ahead and check out the one in Berry at the Princess Parade. So there you go. But today, we are opening up an old speed jewel box. For some reason, I never bought this one when it first came out. Probably because it was super expensive. I think it was like about 30 quid or 35 pounds for this box. And it's only like a box that has eight decks in it. And then you get yourself a few promos that could be very, very useful. And there is a card in this set that is actually meta in speed jewel, if you guys want to know. And that is Creature Swap, which I actually do need. Now, you might be thinking, it's been a long time since I've opened up anything that was Speed Jewel related. It's because that, um, whilst I've been playing at Geek Retreat and everything, as you guys know, foreshadowing, they want Speed Jewel players, but the main meta players say that they absolutely hate Speed Jewel. I'm the only one, and especially Illusion as well, is the only two of us that really do like Speed Jewel. There's also another lad that's named Jordan, and there's one that's called um, Luke. But them two are mainly meta players, but they do, if they have a chance, they may jump on to do Speed Jewel. But we're now getting some new players from Manchester, and they are 100% pure Speed Jewel players. And we're probably making a little bit of a group now, so uh, we might be, um, well, people, oh my god, what a fucking pull. Sorry for the language people, but holy crap, I can't believe it. First promo you get, we get the secret rare Dark Magician, OMFG. I'm trying to calm it down people for today because my throat is extremely painful today because I'm, like I said, I'm not extremely well. But this is awesome. You get four decks, well, four sealed pack slots here, and then you get yourself your play mats, which I am not even gonna look at. But the question is, what are the decks that are pretty much conducted in this? So it's the Streets of Battle City, so... It looks like it's uh, Joey Wheelers, Yugi Motos, Mako Tsunami possibly. There is the Wing, the wing Dragon of Ra possibly in here. Probably Weevil Underwood. And that Psychic fella who has Jinjo originally. Let's go and open up the promos first because these are the ones that we want to look at. And I think in this set, um, there is 22 cards that can be secret rares, but you only get six of them. And one of them is also the Dark Magician Girl, which would be freaking amazing if we get her. But we got Dark Magician, which is the dark version of him, which looks awesome. Um, but let's see what we can pull out of the six promos we can get. There we go! We get us a Slide for the Sky Dragon Secret Rare. That is nice. The prices are on the on the screen as well, people. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Oh, I, I want to scream so much, but my throat is so buggered. But that is an OG original print Dark Magician Secret Rare. That is phenomenal. I have not seen this artwork in God knows how many years. Probably back when I was 10 years old. That is awesome. We get someone's skull, we get all the OGs! Oh my god, that's awesome! Next one. We get Insect Queen, that's cool. That's Weevil Underwood's um, ace card. And Goblin Attack Force. And the next card. Oh, Crush! Wait, wait there's another one. Oh, and Reflect Bounder. Okay, Reflect Bounder is actually a really, really good card because that's like a Mirror Force almost, pretty much. Like, it bounces back the effects. But Mind Crush is a really, really good card. Discard one card, name, and if the opponent has that card in their hand, they can also discard all the copies of it. Otherwise, discard one random card. That is really, really good. Um, out of all them lots, um, I think the best one, of course, to pull is the OG Dark Magician which I am extremely happy on having. Um, I need some actual proper sleeves. Uh, give me two seconds. Me not being prepared as usual. What's what's on earth is wrong with me? Uh, are these it? Yeah, these are it. 
So this is awesome, people, that we've got the OG Dark Magician. That is awesome. And I think that is going to be the most expensive one you can probably pull besides the Dark Magician Girl. But of course, there is a card in here that is called Mind Crush. And that Mind Crush, um, Creature Swap, which is the meta card in Speed Jewel at this moment in time. I'm not surprised if it does get banned soon because it is that much of a broken card. Especially when you use a um, skill card that makes you get tokens every turn. And then you go ahead and use Creature Swap, swap your token with somebody else's card and then boom, and that's it. You, you, you kill them. But let's go ahead and open up this first one here. Let's see what these cards consist and what's in it. Uh, I need to open this up somehow. Do this off camera really quick with a trusty knife. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I can't even do it with a knife. Okay. Ah, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, God damn it. Come on. There we go, got it, after rubbing it too quite hard. Wait, what? <laughs> there we go. Let's pop them out. There we go. So, let's see what these decks consist of. So we've got ourselves the Legendary Fisherman, so possibly this is Mako Tsunami's deck. We've got Akusaur, which I don't recall seeing that before in my life. Flying Fang, these are definitely new cards. Needle Sunfish. Oyster Maester, okay. Uh, Piercing Mowray. Yeah, these are definitely um, some cards that have never been released in the UK or in America. So possibly these like Japanese exclusives. Finally getting into English copies, but that'd be cool. Fiend Kraken, OG card, I love it. Super cool to see this card again. Seven, seven Coloured Fish, Legendary Fisherman number two. Fortress Whale, good to see that card again. We got Salvage, Umi, Water Hazard, Big Wave, Small Wave, Surface, good card. Fortress Whale Oath, that's the ritual card. Uh, Tornado Wall, Deep uh, Fish Depth Charge, another one that I've not seen before. Uh, Parazolic Eldonarch, which I have not really heard of before. This could possibly be. Oh, it's a. Um, it turns into a token. That is really, really good. So that is Mako Tsunami's deck. So I actually really do like that. I am possibly, like I said, we'll put it as a tier list, okay? So at the minute, let me get the ace card for it. Legendary Fisherman. Mako Tsunami is first place at the minute. So we'll put that here. Um, these will be my first, second or third favourite decks that I've seen. So we now have an idea. We've got Insect Queen. So this is going to be Weevil Underwood. Nice, we got uh, Parasite, Chainsaw Insect, <coughs> Magnetic Mosquito, Prickly Fairy, always used to use this card a lot. Homing Insect is good as well. Resonance Insect, there's the other Parasite, the Paranoid, Pinch Hopper, Insect Princess, this used to be a secret rare long, long time ago, people. Uh, Goki Boa, cool card. My, another card I used to use a lot when I was a kid. Metal Armoured Bug. Um, Manipulation of Ants. Insect Barrier. A Sanctuary, that's good. We got the Aerosol, good card as well. Spider's Eggs. DNA Surgery. Dust Tornado. Widespread Ruin, okay. That is quite um, interesting for Weevil Underwoods. So, uh, right, that's... Uh, um, I'm putting that as second place to be honest, people, because I don't. I think Mako Tsunami's deck is a little bit better. So this is definitely the psychic deck, uh, the Jinzo. Okay, Jinzo Lord, O M G, Jinzo Eterna, Reflect Bot Bounder. I know exactly now. Now that if Lucian, if you're watching this, you know exactly now what to do when you're doing Speed Jewel. You need to buy this box three times just to get these cards. Reflect Bounder, Destructoron, Dr. Frankenderp, awesome, Fiend Mega Cyber, Spell Counselor, Cyber Raider, oh wow, finally we've got this card down in the UK, uh, Gold Goyle, it's a good machine card, as a psychic energy shock, yeah Lucian is going to freak out when he sees this, Cosmic Channeling, a Gift of Mirtha, Amplifier, 
Foolish Burial, really, really good. Cosmic Cyclone, wow. Creature Swap, there he is. As a common for Speedjul, it's still a very valuable card. Sa um, Psychic Shockwave, and Mind Crush, and Draining Shield, okay. That, I'm sorry, is going number one spot. That is awesome. Um, let's go ahead and open up this one. This is the Red Eyes deck, so more likely this is going to be Joey Wheeler's deck. Is this going to be better than Jinzo? Let's find that out. <coughs> sorry, people, with the coffin. And yes, yeah, so sorry if this is a long episode here, but like I said, there's a lot, a lot of cards, and I need to get myself back into recording. So we've got the Red Eyes Black Dragon for Joey Wheeler, uh, Gear Golem of the Moving Fortress. Voltic Kong, wow, this is Air Knight Parshaft, uh, Dark Red Enchanter, Twin Battle Dragon, this is very mixed up, uh, Hannibal, Magician of Faith, Mask of Darkness, Sphere Karibo, okay, uh, Leader of the Legerman, Main, A Low Darkness, Twin Twister, Night Beam, Nobleman of Crossout, Pineapple Blast, Melmorph, Mizuru, a uh, Fossil Checkpoint, Floodgate Trapple, really, really good card. That was very, very weird. I don't think that was actually a Red Eyes deck, but I'm going to say no to it. That's not even a great deck. We've got Ghost Stopper, some Spellcasters. Oh, we got Chu Len, the Profiter, used to be an Ultra Rare Slash Secret. Uh, Monk, we got Master of the Barriers, Ghost Destroyer. Bean Jester, Double Caston. Wow, this is a pop. This is Arcane's deck. Oh, this is the Dark Magician. This is the Dark Dark Magician deck. Okay, this is interesting. Two of them, okay. Anti Magic Arrow, Spell Ceiling, Dark Magic Curtain, Thousand Knives, Dark Magic Attack, Summoning Arts, Ceiling, Birthright, Dark Renewal. Wow, okay. That is super, super strong. Um, Insect Queen is out. We're putting that up there. Second place. Revival Jam. This could be the Ring Dragon of Ra deck. By why well, no. Yeah, two Revival Jams. Noid Slime. Worm Drake. React to Slime. Mooka Mooka. We've got the Enraged Mooka Mooka. Uh, Magic Reflect Slime. Very, very strong card back in the day. Sinister Serpent. Mother Grizzly. Uh, Jam Breeder Machine, two of them. Emergency Perversions, Infinite Cards, Token Sunday, there we go. Polymerization, Jam Defender, Solemn Wishes, Token Stampede, and um, the Worm Drake. Okay, so it's this is supposed to be the the, um, the Egyptian God, um, the Winged Dragon of our deck. But for um, Revival Jam, he's actually really, really strong. So I'm putting that on third place. But still, at the minute, Jinzo is super freaking strong. Especially now you've got Jinzo Lord in there as well. Oh, watch out. That is going to be such a strong deck. It's insane. Now we've got Yugi Moto's deck. Dark Magician. Skill Dark Magician. Oh, wow. Alchemist of the Black Spells. That's really cool. Blast Magician. Dark Magician Girl. Buster Blader. Skill White Magician. Break of the Magic Warrior, Apprentice Magician, Magician of Faith, Old Vindictive Magician. We got Displation, Magic Power, Sword of Poison, Spellbook Grasp, two of them. Um, Swordsman's Fusion, that is really, really strong. Miracle Restoring, the Power Stone, ready for Inspiration. Dark Paladin, wow, okay, that is quite insane. Um, I don't think I think it's actually stronger than that to be honest that comes right out there second place this is Joey Wheeler's deck so the red eyes should be in here there we go so give for the Iron Knight two of them Captain Time Wizard Rocket Royal Little Wingard Command Knight the Matchless General Alligator Sword Baby Dragon, um, Roulette Spider, Dice Phone, Graceful Dice, Polarization, 
Reinforcements of the Army, Lightning Blade, Unite We Stand, which I think is banned in the speed jewel, I think, I'm not sure. Blast with Chain, Skull Dice, Kunai with Chain, Nice with the Warrior, we've got Gladiator the D-Knight, Flame Swordsman, Alligator Swords Dragon, and Thousand Dragon. Yeah, that is the Red Eyes Black Dragon deck. And to be honest, it's better than the Arcana's Dark Magician. So, first place is definitely Jinzo, then Yugi Motos, then Joey Wheelers. Jinzo is a lot, lot stronger. But let's see what is left in here, because it says it's got like 20 plus um, skill cards in here, and there's definitely way more than 20 cards in here. So, possibly there's another deck in here, maybe. So, these are the skill cards. We've got Ultimate Wizardry, we got Iron Grit, Gift, a Grit. A Wheel of the Tail. This is the worst card. Insect Infection. This is horrible. Uh, Cosmos. That's where you're um, Jinzos. Ah, it's the Rare Hunters. Okay. And now you see them. Smiley sm Slime. The Dragon Hunting Swordsman. Heart of the Warrior, which I've haste a lot of times in Speed Jewel now. And now I've figured out how to get how to take it out. The Beautiful Ocean. This is another one that is horrible as well, which is um, super strong. Menace, we've got Collector, Terrible Fate, Slimy, Motivation, Kaiba as well, My Valentine, Battle City Siren, we've got Bones, which is cool, and there's more stuff in here, okay, so we've got s probably um, Fiend, a Fiend deck, yeah, uh, Summon Skull, Brain Crusher, oh, these are just extra cards for the um, for the decks, so this is probably for Yugi Moto, Brain Crusher, which is for um, Weevil Underwood, another one for Dark Magicians, Another insect one, cross sword beetle. Ah, oh, gift with the red eyes, iron knight. Cool. Goblin attack force made of Makabi. Good spellcaster. Um, that I keep forgetting what that one's called. Princess of ghosts. Awesome. Oh, that is good as a common right there. Red eyes baby dragon as a common. That is gonna be insane. Reversible beetle. Love your Lantis. Oh my god, Zero the Mance as well. Oh my god. Acid Rain, Book of Teyu, Exchange, The Last Day of the Witch. Very, very old card. Never really got a proper print in the back of the day. Uh, Megaton, Mystical Cannon, Zora Ritual, Barry Behind the Door, Exhausting Spell, um, Arm Shield, Blowback Dragon. We got Dark Scorpions. Cool. Skill Red Magician, another one that's a really, really good card to get a common. The Legendary Ocean, Book of Moon, Fusion Weapon, Hammer Shot, Lost Wind, Reflect Slime, and the Wall of Disc Displution, which I absolutely adore. Yeah, this box, no wonder why this box was worth about 30 quid when it first came out. It is filled with so many great cards, and especially, you get your money's worth with just the sequence alone. And especially, you get yourself that common creature swap. Four, you got yourself some money big time. Either way, people, if you guys enjoyed it, what do you guys think about this speed jewel box? Especially Lucian, if you're watching, get yourself buying this box, mate. You can now play speed jewel properly, mate, with your Jinzos. With that being said, the people I'm speaking will see you guys subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah!